Welcome back with Feature Volcano of the Day, going with Rob Rule and Papua New Guinea, also known as Tavurvur. Tavurvur. Please correct me in the comment section below. Anyways, Caldera, 22,000, no, 2,257 foot elevation. Is dormant, has been since 2014. Tends to be explosive, though. Has, date, has eruptions dating back as far, well, as far back as 1767. But the 1850 eruption is a bit questionable. Anyways, the Rabul volcano was one of the most active and most dangerous volcanoes in Papua New Guinea. Rabul uh, exploded violently in 1994 and devastated the lovely city of Rabul. Since then, the younger cone, Tavruvir, located inside a caldera, has been on the site of near persistent activity in form of Strombolian to volcanian ash eruptions. The caldera has an elliptical form. 14 by 9 kilometers and is surrounded by a steep volcanic ridge uh, se several hundred meters high and known 2020 heads up um, but anyways more infos if at all possible if I can actually get this to work links will be in the description box below nonetheless there we go it's working um, I don't know what's going on it's being a bit with the laggy but there's recent news on this it appears um, that actually may be. Yeah, July 7, uh, 2017 eruption, last update, I guess, but right now. Um, background Rabul is the easternmost member of the volcanic Bismarck Arc and located on the northeastern side of Gazelle Peninsula at the northeast end of New, of New Britain. Thanks to its shape forming at the sheltered harbor city, uh, Rabul City was the island's largest city prior to the major eruption in 1994. The 8-by-14-kilometer caldera was formed by at, by at least two major eruptions, one about 7,100 years ago, all, uh, formed 2V caldera offshore to the north, and a second eruption about 1,400 years ago created the present-day shape. These Planinian eruptions deposited thick, tough layers from pyroclastic flows. So this thing has um, a history with Planinian eruptions, which do appear to be climate-changing eruptions. Anyways, that form from that form the gentle outer slopes of the volcanic complex. The caldera has a wide opening at the east, where the sea forms Blanche Bay. Three small strata volcanoes lie north and northeast outside the caldera. Volcanic activity inside the caldera since the last caldera forming eruption produced various lava rain lavas ranging from basaltic to desertic. Um, several vents have built cinder cones including the historically very active Vulcan and Tavruvir. Other vents in include uh, Teranguna, Rabalanakia, Sulphur Creek, and Kumbiu, which would mean mother and beehives. Okay, all these names and then beehives. I just it just blew me off. Anyways, nineteen ninety four, both Vulcan and Tavirvir erupted simultaneously, for forcing the temporary abandonment of Rao Rule City. Uh, there will probably be photos there. You can click that with the link in the description box below. There's satellite imagery. Horrible excuses as one is completely cloud covered and the other one is in well has dark outlines and Good luck seeing them. Anyways, oh, that's an eruption there. Get to this one, which is likely, um, yeah, intermediate Strombolian to Volcanian type explosions continue at the Tavirvir volcano. Vac Darwin reported an ash plume rising to 10,000 feet, 3 kilometers altitude this morning. And this appears to be the blast. 60,000 feet. Nope, that's a different eruption. 60,000 feet is six times more than a 10,000 foot blast with the other update. Um, both in August of 2014. A large explosive eruption began, began at Tavirvir uh, caldera, volcano, Rabul caldera, this morning. The, vo the eruption seems to be similar to a paroxysm on Etna. The vol the lava fountains and observed ash emissions were observed. The ash plume reached an approximate of 60,000 feet. Aviation color code, code was raised to red. Right now it is in green, which is good, but there's some photos there, and oh my. That is, that is a shot, for sure. I mean, that's... Honestly, I wouldn't mind seeing a volcano go off like this, but as long as I know I'm not in danger. 
from it. But anyways, that does seem to be it. Stay safe. See you in the next video. Bye.